Welcome back to the party. We are here with episode 11 of book 3 of The Legend of Korra. Let's get started. There's a link in the description that will send you to Netflix, which is where I'm watching Korra. Bring the episode down to zero, then we're going to play at the same time. So when you're ready, in 3, 2, 1, go. It's been a second since I have uploaded an episode of Korra, and I apologize for that. It's just, um, I've said this in a few other videos, but if you're only watching Korra... Uh, I, my computer broke, <laughs> so I had to get a new one, and in that time I also took a quick little break from YouTube because I was burning myself out, so it, it, the, the break was like a week long, <laughs> not not a whole lot, but enough that I, you know, it, it missed a lot of episodes, but we're back, more Korra, with only three episodes left in the season, <laughs> including this one, but uh, we're back. I should be paying attention to this because it's been a bit since I've seen an episode. The ultimatum. So the Earth Queen's dead. So what happens from here? And, you know, just bossing Zay in general is just in chaos. Anarchy. <laughs> That's fair. There's too many people for you to stop in. And what are you going to do? Just kill all of them? No. They're right above you. Yep. Oh, no. That's not hers. They're just... I'm just going to take an airship. <laughs> no, they don't care. Why are they even taking apart an airship? Like, who cares? It's just metal pieces at that point. It's not going like, to be that expensive. Go to the palace. Of course not. Well, it's no one's property right now. Their queen's dead. Well, I'm a little harder now that most things are missing. Oh, he's going to kill people. The other, the other way. The other way. Was there an up button? <laughs> I feel like it should be harder to fly an airship, and I don't feel like Bolin should be the one to learn how. <laughs> I feel like airship flying should be a thing for the the police because they use them so often. You're you're gonna die. Just take her. Literally, just take her. It's going to burn down, you... Too bad. <laughs> I mean, yeah. You don't. Fuck off. She is not your god. <laughs> Cora, we came to rescue you with our entire family. They are all just about to commit group suicide, weren't they? Then why didn't you? Well, fuck off. You could be if you wanted it to. Probably the Air Nomad Temple. Shh. 
should is a strong word. And I don't think you will. I mean, you, did you bring any food with you? Or you just kind of left? Oh, there's an airship, so there's a lot of places. There might be a kitchen in there for all I know. Did you? Oh, he did. All right. <laughs> I was skeptical. They left. How is that still there? Dragon? <laughs> okay. Could have landed anywhere else, but you decided to land on the dragon. I literally always forget that the spirits are in the world until one shows up again. I also forgot Pabu was gone, so that confused me for like a good second. I found them real fast. <laughs> okay. Balloon's just the biggest fanboy. He would have loved The Last Airbender. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I mean, it is in the group. She is. No, but okay. Well, about that. We're just going to have to fight all the Air Nomads first, and they're pretty trained at this point. Can you hotwire it to the airship? Zuko just <laughs> flew on the side. Well, he wouldn't just kill them. He would wait for Korra. Because I'm sure he's at least honorable in that sense. Well, she won't have her bending in there, and he's also a pretty good fighter, so I don't know if she'd be able to beat him. 
I feel like you don't need to stay there. Just have that guy do it. This is good for you. Be pretty, pretty convenient if he's there. It's not going to be him. It's going to be someone else. <laughs> Iroh. <laughs> You're just going to find a two You're just going to find a teapot? You know, we always need some Iro advice sometimes in our life, so this is perfect. Couple seasons worth of Rocky. Fuck Sokka, I guess. Wow, he, he gained a lot of wisdom in his later years. Of course. All it takes. <laughs> Stern voice. <laughs> yeah, too late. Fuck. Get on the air bison now, quickly, and run. Run, leave. Skedaddle. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> hmm. Got cold real fast. When well, they're training, but 
Yeah, they're not going to be able to fight the experts. Uh, she might have... She, she could stand the chairs. Well, yeah. <laughs> They're literally, like, all benders. I guess fighting back would probably get them killed. Ooh, he's, yeah. I, I, Boomy? He's not the, the best airbender right now. I kept her up in the airship, that way she could, you know, snipe. No, 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 no. Well, then you gotta bring her down. Yeah, I mean he's a he's an airbender and a fighter now, but he's clear, he's fighting a master airbender right now. He's gonna have a hard fucking time. And like uh, in my comments, I've been saying that all he does is uses the airbending to enhance his fighting. He's not gonna be able to fight Tenzin. Well, I mean, if it gets in close, then sure. Jesus, all right. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. God, waterbenders are scary. Ha, <laughs> fuck you. I mean, yeah. When you're fighting with the same element, you can both use it. Okay, well, that's... How was Boomy supposed to fight this guy? Sure, he was in the army, but he... Barely knows airbending. And he's fighting a lava bender? Like, come on, bro. Ooh, okay. Okay, that's pretty good. Ooh. It'd be a hard target flying around, so... He's not flying around quite yet. Oh, it's maybe a little harder to dodge there, though. The closer he gets, the better advantage he has, I would imagine. Ooh, nice. Yeah, if she wants to do anything, she's going to have to take care of him. I feel like this is... I don't like this music right now. Oh. 
He's he just he just fell. Use, use your airbending to, to, to slow the fall. Oh my god, they're alive. Ooh. Three v one, he's not gonna win. Tenzin's a master, but so are they. He's alive. I think a bison caught him, maybe. Oh no, he got fucking lucky. No! I think Tenzin might be dead, guys. I don't know if they would do that in a Nickelodeon show though, so I don't I don't I don't know. <laughs> uh I guess we'll find out. I just came back from watching JoJo, so I'm now I'm thinking everyone's fucking dead, but I, it's, it's still it's still Nickelodeon, so probably not. <laughs> still though, Jesus. All right, uh, if you guys enjoyed this reaction, like, comment, and subscribe. Super helps out the channel. Links in the description to uh, my Twitter and my Patreon. Also, click that notification bell so you know when the next episode is live. Other than that, thank you for coming to the party.